Hey, hi guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create this kind of pulse effect, gradient, mash kind of effect or animation in Figma. Let's get started. It's quite cool, isn't it? So let's get started now. First of all, let's create a frame like this. Here I have created this frame. Let's make it empty. I will delete everything. Now we have this empty frame. Here we'll start adding some shapes adjust the shapes blah 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 like this and just add a random shapes like this select all these and then uh, give it a random color first of all so i'll make a blue shade now like yeah this looks quite good <laughs> select all these go to the effects and then choose a layer blur give a highest value uh, like 74 will work honestly now give it some background color in a blue shade itself like this yep looks cool now select again all the shapes and go to the blend mode and here choose the pulse lighter now it's look up look awesome now duplicate this like this adjust this la, 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 la. now this is how it will be you know moving here and there again duplicate it now I'll move this to here, this will go here, this will go go here, this will go here. This is the most tough part here, moving all these things properly. So take your time, it's just a tutorial. So I'll just select all the frames now and create a component set. Select the first frame, go to the prototype, attach with the second after delay, one millisecond linear 200 uh, 2000 and smart animate second frame select then attach with the third one select the after delay one millisecond smart animate linear 2000 and then select the last frame and attach with the first one and give it give the same values after effect sorry after delay one millisecond and smart animate and linear that's it that's it now the animation is ready what I'm gonna do now, I'll create a frame like this. I'll duplicate this, whatever we have created, and just this in a the center. Then I'll run this frame. Here we go. Looks cool, awesome. Give it some time, adjust these positioning and and play with the shapes. So it'll you can get more better result. Thanks so much. Have a great day.